Welcome back to my channel guys. Today I'm gonna do something a little different. If you follow me on Twitter, and if you don't, you should. It's right here. I asked my Twitter followers to ask me anything they wanted to ask me. I'm gonna do a Q&A today while I pack for my trip that I'm going on this weekend. So, to get started, the first person, Arlene Young, 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 if I'm saying it wrong, I'm sorry. She asked me, where are you going on your trip? So I'm gonna start with that question. I'm going to Washington DC just for the weekend from Friday to Monday. I have no clue what to pack yet, to be honest with you. So I'm just gonna wing it. Story of my life. Um, let's see what the weather is gonna be like. So I thought I was going to get to a little cooler weather. It looks like I'm going to be in the 80s still, which is better than Florida, but we'll see. It's supposed to be like mid 80s. I'll pack accordingly to that. So let's get started. So I think as I'm packing, I'm just going to answer some questions here and there. So Karma Jolie asked me, where do you see yourself in five to seven years? Well, let's see. How old am I? I'm 24. So I'll be like between 29 and 33. Um, hopefully I'll have kids by then and I'll be done having kids. Hopefully I'll also be married by then. Hopefully I'll be very successful in whatever I'm doing, perhaps YouTube. Louise asked me, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you go? By the way, I love your videos, keep doing what you're doing. Thanks girl. Um, if I could go anywhere in the world, I've always dreamt, dreamt, yeah, dreamt of going to South Africa. I, like, want to do a safari ride so bad over there. Like, that's my dream is to just do a safari ride in South Africa. I think that is so cool and play with, like, the elephants. Um, that's one destination I really would want to go to. Uh, New Zealand looks so pretty. Switzerland. How many kids do you plan on having? Susie asked me this. So I started out with about five kids, but let's be realistic. I don't know if I can have five kids or if I could handle, I, I think I could handle five kids, but I would like to have at least three, if not more, but start off with three the most. Um, what else do I need? There's some jeans in there. So far I have black jeans, black leggings, this shirt, some underwear. I'm only going to be gone for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, four days, but like two full days. I leave Friday mid-afternoon, I come back Monday kind of early. So it's only Saturday and Sunday, I really need to pack for. Next question, Michaela. When will you and Mitchell get in your new house? And if so, are you going to do a house tour? Me and Mitchell close on our house on October 5th. So that's coming up quite soon. Yes, I will do a house tour. I'll do an empty house tour. I told, I don't know if you just heard my mom in the background scream. I told her not to scream because I've noticed and sometimes when I record videos, I can hear her screaming in the backgrounds to the dogs, like making these weird noises. So I told her she's not allowed to do that while I'm filming. And she just did it and she goes, oops. Anyways, who's this? G Gio? I don't know if I'm saying his name right. What was the first thing you thought about when Karen asked you to be Jackson's godmother? So when Karen asked me to be Jackson's godmother, I I was honestly so happy and like I I was so happy. I don't even I don't know what else to say. I was really, really excited. And honestly, I didn't think I could fall in love more with a kid than I ever have in my life. Like, I obviously don't have my own, but I'm just saying like, that little boy is my heart and soul, seriously. He's the greatest gift ever. Next person asks, when do you think Mitchell will propose? I have no idea. That's for Mitchell to answer. Hopefully soon. Shannon asks, when do you think Mitchell will propose, by the way? Hi, Shannon. Isa Teraves asked, do you want to visit Amsterdam? Amsterdam is actually on one of my trips I would like to visit. Mitchell's been there and he, when he went there, he was like, we have to go there whenever we get a chance. So I for sure do want to visit Amsterdam. 
Julia, Jewel, Jewel asks, are you planning to get another doggo? Yes. I am planning on getting another dog. I don't know when, but Brady will definitely need a little brother or sister. And most of you know I want a French Bulldog. I also want to adopt because I just feel bad for all the dogs that are in shelters. Like, it breaks my heart. I don't know what else to pack. Shorts? I don't know. Should I bring shorts? Isabella Montana asks, what's your favorite kind of food? Example, Mexican, Chinese. Who? I really love Mexican food. I love rice and beans. I love burritos. I really like Mexican food. But I also really like Chinese food. And I love Italian food. <laughs> Laura asks, who's your celebrity crush? I don't know. I don't really have like... Someone I'm like, oh my god. Karen, KK and Baby J asks, when do you want babies? <sighs> now? I'm just kidding. No, I want babies probably in like, after I get married, I want me and Mitchell to spend some time as a married couple. Probably when I'm like 26, 27-ish. I don't know, we'll see. Kira, okay baby, asks me, when are you coming to Utah? Soon, girl. I actually really want to visit Utah. Maybe next time I'll go with KK and Baby J. Oh man, Diema, Diema asks, is South Africa a place you'd ever like to visit? Yes! I already answered, well I already said that I would love to visit there, but yes, South Africa definitely is. Tina? Tina? Quasfa? I don't know. Tina? I, I, I think I'm saying it right. How are you liking YouTube so far? I absolutely love it. Like, I'm so happy I started this. I'm so happy Karen guided me to do this. Like, is the greatest thing ever. Like, it's awesome. I love it. I, like, thoroughly enjoy filming. I thoroughly enjoy editing. I, like, feel proud of, like, what I accomplish while I'm putting these videos out for you guys. Every time I finish a video, I'm like, damn, that was a good video. I, like that. I really like this one. Chelsea Marie asks, what are, your, well, what are your goals when it comes to YouTube? Love you, by the way. Wish the best for your channel and wish we'll meet as friends once. Aw, oh, thank you. When it comes to YouTube, my goals are to be successful in it obviously i'm sure that's anyone's goals but i don't like i don't know eventually i would love to do daily vlogging but i know it's like so time consuming and i i'm not ready for daily vlogging yet but maybe one day i can do that i want to push out more videos a week i'm trying to i'm gonna work on putting out three videos a week so stay tuned for a third video I'll it's gonna be another surprise. You won't know when it's coming. Evan asks, what's one conspiracy theory that you believe? I really believe in aliens. Tara asks, what is your favorite movie? My favorite movie is Elf and The Notebook. Those are like my two favorite movies. I could watch them all the time. Tara again, what is your favorite quote? Girl, I saw you didn't know on Twitter what questions to ask me and then she threw me like three questions and they were really good questions. Um, my favorite quote is, you could be the juiciest, ripest peach in the world, but there's still somebody that doesn't like peaches. This is my favorite quote because it literally means you cannot please everyone. And I feel like I'm the person that like tries to please everyone. Like I try and go out of my way to do this and that and make everyone happy, but there's still gonna be that someone that won't be happy of what you're doing. Cass, Cassandra Cook asks, what is your dream career? Oh boy. My dream career is probably to work with animals. Like if I could just lay on a farm and have all the animals cuddle me and play with them, that just sounds awesome. Like, I don't know, I really like animals. Or something to do with fashion. Those are like two different things, but I really enjoy animals and I really love fashion. Nikki asks, favorite Starbucks drink? Oh my god. So my best friend Cassie, you guys know who she is, got me hooked on this drink. Iced cinnamon almond milk macchiato. You have to go try it. It is so good. Okay, I'm gonna answer a couple more questions and then that'll be it. Morgan asks, if you had to dye your hair any unnatural color, what color would you choose? Not brown, black. If you guys follow me on Instagram, and if you don't, you should. I once dyed half my hair pink, like the tips of my hair pink. So if I had to dye my hair any unnatural color, it'd probably be pink. So I answered a lot of questions and got no packing done. <laughs> but actually, like, 
that was so much fun answering your guys' questions. Like, I've never done a Q&A before, so I'll have to do one again. Maybe I'll do one with Mitchell. Well, this is all I've packed. <laughs> so I have this white, just this plain white t-shirt, underwear, <laughs> stocks. I got nothing done. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and do that. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked me doing a Q&A. Um, I actually really enjoyed doing this Q&A, even though I got no packing done. I blame you. I will see you guys on Sunday. Stay tuned for Sunday's video. I'm going to do a challenge with Mitchell, I think. Bye! Oops. My camera's about to die. Are you, Jaslyn asks, are you right-handed or left-handed? I am right-handed, but I mainly do everything left-handed.